What's up, y'all? It's your girl Tasha here, and this is week three of the Hot Girl Summer Salad. Um, what we're going to do today, because I know y'all do not want to see me make this salad for the third time. So if you are new here and you're just stumbling up on my video, I want to say welcome, but make sure you go back and take a look at week one and week two, just so you can have a thorough, a thorough understanding of what I'm, what I got going on and how I'm doing, how I'm incorporating my hot girl salad. Um, so make sure you go back and check out those videos and then come back over here so you can, you know, follow up on what's going on. But, um, what I'm going to do this time, instead of me making the hot girl summer salad on camera, because I've already done that twice, I'm going to take y'all along with me to get the things I need to make my salad this week. Um, today is Monday, April 11th, and um, we'll also discuss how last week went. So yeah, if y'all want to get this update, honey, just keep on watching. All right, y'all, so as I drive to the grocery store, I'm going to give you an update on how last week went. Lord, let me put my seatbelt on because I don't want to hear this the whole time. Let's see. I really hate that it's raining today too. But anyway, I would say um, last week was okay. Monday through Thursday, excellent, excellent. I stuck to it. Um, I did make fish. I had, what did I cook? What kind of fish was that? I had tilapia. I know everybody don't like tilapia, but I still eat tilapia. I had baked tilapia with green beans. And I also had um, some baked chicken with the hot girl summer salad. So me incorporating the chicken and fish was the new thing that I did for week two. But other than that, I still was eating the skinny pop, popcorn. I still ate um, the Morning Star nuggets. And I also ate um, the hot girl summer salad. So that's what I had in rotation. But child, when Friday came, because you know my anniversary was Saturday. My wedding anniversary was Saturday. Celebrated six years. Woo -woo. Won't he do it? <laughs> um, Friday night. I don't. I wouldn't necessarily say I ate bad. I bought some A Town wings for my family. If you're from the Huntsville area, I'm sure you know about A Town wings. I don't think they're breaded. I think they're just fried naked. And I had um, garlic parmesan wings from A Town. No sides. I don't even think I, I didn't even eat the hot girl summer salad. Now that I think about it, I just had the wings and um, I drank me some wine. Uh, Saturday, during the day, I still ate like I would normally. I had the Morning Star Nuggets, my green tea, and um, we end up going to the Cheesecake Factory. The Cheesecake Factory, I don't think it's been in Huntsville for a year. And um, I've been in Atlanta and in Birmingham, but my husband has not been at all. So that was what we did together. It was okay. It wasn't the best because I'm used to dining and, you know, nice. I'm not saying Cheesecake Factory ain't nice. It was just, it was okay. But um, what did I get? I had the Parmesan crusted herb chicken with mashed potatoes and green beans. Not bad. I could have done without the mashed potatoes, which y'all, I love mashed potatoes. So I, I did enjoy my food. I didn't even eat it all. Didn't even eat it all. But, um, yeah, I had that. I, I also drank me some champagne. But yesterday, on Sunday, that's the day where I show my ass. Yesterday, my mom had made some ton of greens. She baked some chicken and she fried some chicken, but my ass just had to get that fried chicken. I had to have that fried chicken. So yeah, that's how week two went for me. But, um, and I already discussed with y'all that I'm not weighing in this week because I already knew, I already knew what the weekend was gonna be because I was celebrating my anniversary. So I enjoyed it. I don't, I don't personally feel like I went crazy with it. 
but um, I, I did not stick to the diet. So I don't want to weigh in and be um, discouraged by the number on the scale. So that's why I chose not to weigh in this week. Plus, if you watch week two's video, I also discuss how I don't really like stepping on the scale too much within the first 21 days because I want to get in the habit of doing what I'm supposed to do. So this week, week three, we're jumping back on it. We're actually gonna go back to week one. So I'm not gonna be eating any fish or chicken, just the veggie nuggets, smoothie, hot girl summer salad. Um, if I'm missing anything, y'all, because I'm driving, this is my first time driving while recording myself. So if I miss anything, please click down in the description box below. Um, all the details will be there because like I told y'all when I start recording my mind just be like scattered but um The only thing that I need is some more cucumbers. I need some Roma tomatoes and I need some um, Skinny pop popcorn. I got everything else at my house So I'm going to Kroger right now to get the things that I need Oh, and I also need some more morning star nuggets. I hope they have some nuggets because I looked in the app just to see if they have the nuggets. I shop everywhere, y'all. I don't just shop at one grocery store. I be at Walmart. I be at Publix. I be at Kroger. I be wherever I can get what I need. Because, you know, some grocery stores don't carry all the products. Everything that you need. Like, certain stores have certain things that I go for. So, I'm going to Kroger today to get my produce. Um, I, might, I think I'm going to get some more eggs, too just to be on the safe side plus my husband asked me this morning so are you gonna make some more of that hot boy salad <laughs> i'm like yeah i'm gonna make some more of the hot girl summer salad because he he actually likes it too he likes it as well so i'm gonna make sure i make enough for the both of us so yeah y'all i'm excited i'm gonna get back on it I will weigh in at the end of this week just so y'all can, you know, see how I'm doing, making sure the girl is doing what she's supposed to do and sticking to the diet. I'm not going to lie. Yesterday, or I, I guess I'd say over the weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, after like putting those sugars back in my body, I really had like a craving for more sugar. It's crazy how sugar will really, it's addictive it's addictive because like once you start it's like you just want to go in but i thank god that my mentality is in the right place because i really want to get 20 pounds off i really do i need to and i really think i was looking at myself yesterday when i got ready for church and i stared at myself in the mirror and i was like you know what i ain't mad at this weight i ain't mad at it i really think I look good. <laughs> I mean, I know somebody else could be like, girl, no, you can lose 20 pounds plus. No, but the way I feel, I feel great. I felt like I look good. But um, I don't know. I want to lose some so I can have some cushion, you know, for anything. Pregnancy, more weight, you know, who knows. But I do want to get it off and be healthy and just feel good about myself. But anyway, y'all, I feel like I'm starting to rambling. So I'm going to cut the video here. And I will see y'all again once we get to Kroger. So holla at y'all.
Y'all, I end up putting those buffalo veggie nuggets back because it was 210 calories for five nuggets. I feel like that was kind of high. So yeah, I'm gonna put that back and I guess I have to go to Walmart to see if I can find the Parmesan ones. Hmm, now I'm over here by the ice cream and I'm like, step away, Tasha. So I guess I'm gonna just walk away. I literally think I have everything I came for though. Like the cucumbers, the only two tomatoes they had, the morning star nuggets and some eggs. I don't think I need anything else, but I'm going to walk over here by the salad dressing just to be sure. Make sure it's not something I see that I wanna try. You know what? The girl in the original video used Kroger brand oil and vinegar. Let's see, do I see that? I see Zesty Italian. And you know what, I actually have the Kroger brand Zesty Italian at home. You know what, just to give myself a different taste every week, I'm gonna I'm a do Zesty Italian today when I make the salad. So yeah, Tasha, let's just do that, girl. Okay. All right, y'all, so I'm back in my car now and I just wanna keep it all the way 100 with y'all cause I don't wanna lie to my subs. It ain't even about lying cause it's like, I really don't even have to say this, but I do want to let this be known. Um, I've only been doing YouTube maybe like, I know I'd be looking in the wrong spot. I guess I'm supposed to look here. I've only been doing YouTube maybe two or three months now. And this was my first time like taking my camera along with me in the store as I shop. Um, I do have a vlog on my page, but I mean, I was in a bar slash club. Like, it, it's not uncomfortable to take your phone or your camera in the club with you, but to be in a grocery store where people are shopping, where people may possibly be staring at you. Like, I think that fear of that all went away today because I can't lie. Before I came here, I had the thought in my mind, like, oh my God, people are gonna be looking at me with my camera. And I know I probably didn't do much. I know from what y'all saw, it probably wasn't much, but it did take a lot out of me to do it. And um, I just feel good about it. And as I was like filming the skinny pop, you may hear it on camera, I'm not sure, but there was a man, he was stocking the shelves and he was like, do you need me to get that out your way? Cause there was like a little tall, um, you know how they be restocking and there's like the, I don't know what you call that thing. A dolly you know I don't know but there was this tall thing in the way and I'm just like no it's fine it just made me feel good because he, he was like I see what you're doing so you know and I'm just like come on y'all it's 2022 people vlog like this is our world we live in now so I don't know I just wanted to share that with y'all because I actually I feel good about it and I feel like I can continue to do this maybe when I do fashion I can take y'all shopping with me like I could do this it wasn't fun. It almost make you feel like you a celebrity, sort of, kind of. I can't explain it. I can't explain the feeling, y'all, but it was really it was really dope. Um, hopefully, I get better at it. Because, like I said, I'm sure the shots I got, y'all probably like, girl, that ain't nothing. But I did it. I did it. I did. And um, sorry to ramble, y'all, but I just had to throw that in there. But anyway, I'm going to stop at Walmart to see if I can find those Parmesan nuggets. And I'm going to take my butt on home. I don't think I have anything else to say about this week again. We're just going to do week one over again. So if you're like, what what did you do on week one? Go check out week one video. Everything is outlined there. I think I said it. In week two video, I specified the water intake. So yeah, just thank y'all so much for rocking with me and vibing with me. This is a journey and I have gotten so many subscribers. Thank you guys. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for seeing something in me. Just thank you. It's gonna get better. 
it's already good but we're gonna make it better so just um keep vibing with me if it's something you want to see from me let me know let me know because the only way i'm gonna know is if you tell your girl so let me know and uh let's see is there anything else i don't think there is but um, for those of you guys who are on this journey with me, I just want to say good luck. You can do it. Push through. If you have any special engagements that you want to celebrate, celebrate them. Don't limit yourself because you know deep down you're not going to live your the rest of your life without whatever it is that you love. So, you know, treat yourself here and there and then get back on it like I'm doing. Just get back on it. But again, you guys, I hope you have a great work week. I hope you have a great day. I love you guys. And that's it, y'all.